You'll never be for without. You'll never do. You'll never be without of. Fuck. One good thing about Jeeps, you'll never be out of things to film for your channel. Just make a Jeep channel, they said. You'll have tons of content. Oh, yeah. So today, if you have changed your oil pan gasket seal, your rear main seal, your valve cover gasket seal, your Arctic seal, what the fuck, your mama seal, and still no no luck, you still have a puddle of fucking oil every time you come out to your car. Your Jeep. Every time you come out to your Jeep. Uh, excuse me. It's probably going to be the seal behind that guy. And there's three O-rings. Three. Three. A big one. And two little fellas. And that thing he's, that thing he's screwing in will pop out. Trust me, you just got to fucking whack it. And then uh, it'll pop right out. And then, I mean, to get the actual unit out, you're gonna need a breaker bar and a either, what was it, either a T60. A T60 or a 9 16th Allen. Or a 9 16th Allen. You're gonna have to buy it in one of those fancy sockets like this guy, and then put it in a vise. And we heated this up a little bit with a torch first to melt the epoxy that holds it in. You can also, Hit it with a hammer with a screwdriver. If your screwdriver is not hard enough, heat, heat the tip of the screwdriver first with a torch till it's red hot. Dip it in some water, it will harden it. And then whack this thing straight through here with the screwdriver. It'll pop right out. You can do the same thing with the T60. Reason being, because you cannot fit anything in there other than that. So you're gonna have to put, I think with the T60, you end up putting a 12 over it. 12. That's like a 97 and up. And if it's a 9 16 which is 96 and older, then 14. you're going to need a 14, usually, depending on which socket size you use. Blah, blah, blah. Anyway, so to remove that fitting, knock it apart, get this guy, the Dorman D2560, get that. It'll have not only the big O-ring for the big guy, it'll have the little guys as well. Match up with the old O-rings. It's not that hard. Oh God, come back to me. Oh, don't run away. That's still good. Match up the O-rings. Put the fucking thing back on. Tighten it back down. Don't listen to what anybody tells you about taking off the, the 90 adapter, completely removing it. There's a roll pin in there. And unless you have the motor out, you're not getting that fucking roll pin out. And then, would you put red Loctite on that? No. You cunt. That's it, so if you got an oil leak and you can't figure it out, it's probably it. 4.0 Jeep. Fix it. Thanks for watching. Like if you like, subscribe if you want to see more, and as always, guys. Keep modding. Yeah. Sorry, buddy. I hate you. You, me, you knew. Yeah. You did it. <laughs>